I know what you're thinking, but I can't... Your earplugs will prevent your drums from rupturing. Exhale completely. You'll have to sprint. It's only minus 19 Celsius and no risk of frostbite. It's theoretically possible. This is the worst idea ever. I should have kept going that way. So I know how long I've got, so... Ooh, it's not as close as I thought. Oh, yay. Well, maybe I won like a Guinness Book of World Records or something. For that crap. And why is it discovered? Shane, come on, come on, check in. I'm here. Uh, I'm freezing. Headache is back. My ears are ringing. I should be dead. Jesus, slow down. Fuck, catch your breath, please. Are you good? Tell me you're good. Can you walk at least? <laughs> I'm still standing, hoping I'm not going into shock. I lost 40 years in 10 seconds. <laughs> okay, okay, we'll, we'll get you looked at as soon as we can. Hang in there. It's gotten worse, Declan. Way worse. I'm going to the water purifiers. I hope it'll be enough. Okay, well, after what you just did, you better... Fucking kill that thing. body here. Jesus. The impact site is a smoldering mess and we don't really have the time or the equipment to search through all this. Are you alright? Yeah. Mars sucks. But, no, it's not two circles. Nope, nope. There are two filtration tanks down here. Gotta inject them both. Let's see if it works.
Declan, it really didn't like that. The poison is already polluting the water supply. Oh, that's a win. Now get up to the environmental control console and dump the entire reservoir on that bastard. Uh, Shane, we found something. Josie saw a door along the escarpment near the crash site. She wants to check it out. A door? Carved out of the cliff. It's massive. I told her I need the recon with you, but she's fixated on this. Orochi has secrets upon secrets. It, it is Orochi, right? Apparently, we're going to find out. Nice. Oh, oh, there we go. Cool. That's great. Yeah. closer now. This thing won't stop. Maybe if I pump the last dose into the roots around the bay. Ah! Hello, little foolish. <laughs> Okay, I pressed the button. I, uh. But hey, I'm a flashback, so. Let's see how many times this thing can kill me before I figure out. Guess I hold the button down, maybe? Uh. Should be fun. I, mean, I don't know how far I can move. Did that do it? No, it's still alive, but I can get closer now. This thing won't. What is this?
Okay. Come on. Ugh. Volkova. She's being controlled by the tree. She is the tree. What the hell? How? The tree, her, her specimens, the black infection everywhere. She's not even human anymore. Kill me. Please. Kill me. I'm sorry, lady, but... That <laughs> tree hugger. And I got... Can you access Ina's files? I just saw Ina the other day. She wasn't like this. Shay, focus. The Cyrano crash, the black oil, the plant life expanding exponentially. This doorway, it's all connected. Where are you? I'm coming. I'm getting out of here. No. You need to access Ina's computer and find out exactly what she was up to. <sighs> My God, are you kidding me? Shane, think. The Cyrano is gone, and our resupply with it. If the main base goes down, we're all dead. If Volkova's research still poses a threat, we need to know. You want to find out what she was up to? You come and do it yourself. I don't care. Hey, listen, I know. I know you've been through a lot. I'm sorry. We all have. You're right. I bet the seats on the rover are just unbearable. Hey, listen, buddy. I've spent all afternoon picking up whatever pieces I could find on the Cyrano crew. Don't act like you're the only one who's having a tough day. Anytime you want to trade places, you be my guest. Oh, Fuck off! Enough! Both of you! Dr. Newhart, do you read me? Commander Wilcox. Your primary objective is to assess any further threat to the base. Volkova was clearly hiding things from us. Use her security clearance to obtain whatever information you can find. You are to remain at base and radio your findings to your off-site team. Copy? Yes. Copy. We're headed to the cliffside doorway. If there's proof of intelligent life on Mars, I want to know. I want everyone to know. Declan, you're on comms. Got it. Hey, uh, sorry to be a dick. Yeah, me too. All right. I can do this. I mean, if I were to start somewhere, it'd be able to call this computer. Right. I'll check with her station in the research lab. Maybe she left a note or something. You got this. Uh... Why is it? Mm. Oh, yes, yeah, so I have to remember five five three eight. Go, Tommy. From oh. Oh, nice. Father. Zero point pathogen is marginally better. Henceforth, I will refer to it as Z-Pad. Okay. And... See, you will have all that and more. Ugh. No yell here. Declan, there's an elevator. In the center of the research lab. The server room has an elevator. Oh, shit. I've walked by it a hundred times. Go in the elevator. Don't make me go in the elevator. At least I don't make. I don't have creepy fuckers jumping around on me. What the? 
What is this? Is this another one of the damn... Why can't I read this? Oh, okay. This is... I can't even read that. Why is that not... Okay, never mind. Yeah, okay, fine. Sorry. I'm sorry. You couldn't just stay open. I'm heading down. I'm having doubt. Instead of heading... Oh, wait. Research? Service tunnel? Processing? Argus? Icarus? Uh... Service? No? Research lab? Access denied? Okay. Processing? Okie dokie. Argus? You go to Argus. Okay. Cool. I'm going to Argus now. I thought she had full access to everything. There's the service tunnels. There's something. Processing. Yay! Arc. Uh, no. No! Can I? Can I not? Do I? <sighs> Shit. Okay. Saving, and I am now taking a break. Uh, hope you guys have enjoyed everything so far. Uh, this is a drink slot, and we'll get back with. Moons of Madness in just a little bit.